Welcome to my Lotor ear tutorial. This is a tutorial for how I painted my Lotor ears to match my makeup. As you can see, I've already done the base coat on one, but I'm just starting with a base coat of the same makeup that I do on my face, which is just an alcohol activated Mehran purple face paint makeup thing. And I'm just generally applying that all over the place, trying to cover up the skin color that is underneath. And I'm just making sure that I get all of the cracks and crevices here during this process, or at least trying to get them as much as I can during this base coat that I'm doing. So these ears are from a Renaissance festival. There's a company that makes them, but I don't remember where. Uh, you can also buy ears like this online or something. I believe these are the small anime ears or something like that. I'm not sure. You just want to make sure that you get the sides and the corners. And here I'm just using a makeup sponge with 97% alcohol. Really, you should go for 99% alcohol, but that was the best I could find in not a specialty makeup store. Now I'm just going in with a brush and getting more into the cracks and crevices and getting a larger coat on the ears with the same makeup. I'm also doing the edges of them so that if you see any of the edges when it's glued onto my ear, they're still purple. Now I'm going in with a darker color, and this is the color I also use to contour for a lot of my Lotor makeup. And I'm just going in and making the little bits of the inside of the ear darker, and then I'm also going in where I think would be the darkest places on an ear naturally, which would be like the creases in the ear. So wherever has the most blood flow would be the darker places, technically. So I'm just brushing that on kind of sloppily. I'm not paying a great attention to detail here. If you wanted to, you could go in with a smaller brush, but then I'm just blending it out with my fingers anyway. So I'm trying to get like a nice gradient going through the ears. And then I'm also doing the back bottom of them where they would like connect to your head basically, because that's where a lot of your blood flow is in your ears. And towards the top, they're more just cartilage and paler colored. And there you have it, the ears are finished. I just applied these with spirit gum and put them on backwards and cut them to fit my ear that way because that's how I wanted them to lay and point. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to check up the full makeup tutorial that goes with these ears, you can check it out on my channel.